It's been about two weeks since the news broke that Herberger's parent company was going out of business and closing all of their stores. As the store goes through the liquidation process and sells off all of its merchandise, it's the longtime employees that will be missed the most. And Thielen of St. Joseph is one of the sales managers at the downtown St. Cloud store, and she's worked there for 31 years. She says she's seen a lot of changes in the department store over the years. We had in Center Square, we had um, a restaurant, we had a card shop, we had another store, a couple of restaurants downstairs. Um, I moved our shoe department down the block, so it used to be um, more towards the middle of the store. Thielen says it's the friendship she's made with her co-workers and customers that kept her at the store over the years. And Thielen says a favorite memory is the cookbook giveaways they used to do on Thanksgiving. Literally, we would give cookbooks out at 6 o'clock in the morning and we would see kids in pajamas and uh, parents uh, dragging them in. It's freezing cold and they're here to get a cookbook. Debbie Lorette of St. Cloud has worked at the downtown department store for 32 years. She's now in the accessories department and says she has met a lot of great friends at the store. They started shopping when I started working and we just somehow became friends. Lorette says the news of the store closing has been just as hard on her loyal customers as it is on her. She thinks the customers are probably a bit more loyal because the downtown store is more of a destination location. They had to make an effort to come downtown. They had to fight parking, um, things like that. So it was important for them to actually come to her burgers and shop. Lorette says she and her co-workers have always taken great pride in their customer service. And Carol Trunow of Sock Rapids has worked at the department store for 33 years. She says she started in alterations when Herberger still had a bridal shop, and she says the customers will be missed. Actually, just yesterday I had a customer come in, and she said, I have a thank you card for you, and she said I put my phone number in there so we can stay in touch. We don't know yet how long the store will stay open, but the longtime employees like Trunow say they plan to continue to take great pride in the store to the very end. You have to have a good attitude. You have to, you can't, you can't be crabby because it was nothing in our power. Court documents say all stores will be closed no later than August 31st. From St. Cloud, Jim Maurice, WJON.